This is how I kept my footwear safely. It's a plastic shoe container I got from Shopee. I bought this cause it looks neat and arranged well. Here is my first piece of footwear. To show y'all, here is my sandal dupe from Shopee. This is so affordable that costs only 200 pesos. Estimated, this was made of a rubber that's so comfortable to wear. Forever, I can wear this all around if I will go somewhere. Here's my first photo I styled with my dupe sandal with my low rise denim skirt and simple gray kami top. I like this fit that resembles in white okay. Then here's the outfit inspired by the kid core aesthetic outfit. As you see here, the green and yellow combination of the fit style in a cardigan and midi skirt and underneath the blue kami is like a nature tone of the outfit. Then here's the last photo here and we can see that i styled this with a cute aesthetic outfit i decided to pair the green and gray color combo with my style i wore the low rise baggy pants here and it's really cute so much i can't leave the house without wearing my converse duke shoes i got again from shopee i remembered that time i bought this with free shipping i got this in 2020 and it's still the same and not yet damaged here how i style my converse dupe with my outfit this was taken last december this style looks like granny core but still love it this style is mine because it's more comfortable to go around and i bet it's my style so much and here's my style converse dupe with my lower rise jeans i love this outfit and looks so much not gonna lie i like that double layered and two commies i inspo this style to y2k and this was taken last month before i went to school to get my certification and here's the sandal i bought from shein from the photo it looks looks like a platform because i've been looking for the platform sandal still like the sandal never regret it here's the photo how i style sandal outfit was supposed to be inspired by rory gilmore how i style sandal with the black stockings and bloated jackets next outfit i obsess with this style since i love to pair with socks in my footwear this look was so preppy and cute i love this outfit i styled by myself like over and over i never stopped wearing my sandals with socks because i love them all so much and i already posted this in my tiktok account if you want to watch just go and for the last photo, I style with the baggy pants with a cockade top. And here is the footwear I wore of my outfit, the dope of Doc Martens. The fact that this was my first ever purchase when I started to upgrade my style since the shoe was a trend. And I'm still wearing this today because it's a bit more comfortable for me to wear. This first fit my fave style with a leg warmer and a pattern dress. Then here I wore with a low rice leg warmer on my hands then at our graduation ceremony i wore my doc martin's dupe with a lingerie dress i love it but i can't keep this dress anymore then here i style with a black midi skirt to inspo it into one office core look then here with a short oversized sleeves yeah oversized sleeves i guess so yeah 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 this photo was of y2k trend edit before this photo was taken on my boyfriend 22nd birthday so this was a cottage core inspired in this photo i styled my shoes in a shirt tuck up and a low rise pants here i wore a preppy outfit look here as you see i styled by my beach pants and truffle top with the leopard bag so cool i have mary jane shoes i got from shopee i love the glossy leather material of this footwear that can easily damage the fabric and always look so neat not a problem when you step on the mat because the glossy keeps clean the shoes so much and i'm still wearing this whenever i made uh, content uh, clothes content on youtube and as you see the glossy on this item i really like like it and i really wear this so much all over and here's the photo i style the resemblance to the cockade fit looks like an accurate to my style here's the second fit so here's the second fit 
I fit in a fitting room in H&M I tried to fit this outfit and then decided to buy this outfit for the last photo I style this fit in a cyber Y2K type and of the outfit I love this style of short I wore it in this photo because this was a trend style I've never worn mini skirt in my life and this short really hits different for me here I have a platform boots from Shopee I bought this it's like a three years ago still stable to wear yet there's like something the leather is not the same as when I first got these boots but still my boots slayed so much and I can style this every thing like whenever I wear a skirt or like a shorts itself but it's a really good to wear with the skirts yeah so much of so here how i style my boots i wore my pleated skirt with a betty book baby tea loving this style so much because i feel like i'm a downtown aesthetic girl this is so pretty style next i have here my style yeah here's with another photo and for the other photos and this was inspired with a fairy core style this was the time when i was still obsessed in this aesthetic since fairy core grudge aesthetic is more like a trend and i wore with a vest skirt and a long sleeve and here's you see my duke duke martin's low cut boots i bought i know you guessed from it's from Shopee. I love this purchase so much and I've never regret to buy this footwear. It's really looking good to style with my outfit. And speaking of, here's how the boots looks like. And so stable. And I really love the platform style of these shoes. And the style was a preppy aesthetic. I love my ginger hair era, but we'll go back to that hair anyways. It's just I'm not so much satisfied by the photo, but so far I love this style so much. Then here is the style with my navy pants and my baby top underneath with a basic shirt. That's all. Thank you guys for watching. See you.